İki tane el doğru macisiz. Let's give it a bite. Let's go. <gülüyor> Thank you very much. Guys, right now we're in Zirjili Han. Uf. Doydum. Guys, you're gonna love this. Hey guys, how are you today? Very excited. Today I'm taking you to the Grand Bazaar of Istanbul, which is one of the most historical place in Istanbul. And I did a video here, I'm sure you remember. And all the treasure are hiding right here. I think the Grand Bazaar have been built by Sultan Fatih around 1455, which is very old. And that's why I love coming here, because you find everything, spices, jewelry, craft, carpets, everything you want basically is right there. And we're gonna walk together, we're gonna go through together, we're gonna try some food, some street food, having a beautiful day together so you have an idea of what is the Grand Bazaar. Let's roll. So now we're gonna walk inside the Grand Bazaar. We will see what we find on the way. Basically no plan. If I remember well, is not that entrance for the baklava is that one there. Wait, wait, I'm, I'm not sure. No, no, no, it's there. No, no, no, no, no. It's always busy. There is no one day which that place is not busy. Look at the pattern and the colors of those carpets. Wow, beautiful, beautiful. Those rug, opa, are really beautiful. Look on the way they put them on the street, just randomly. Look at the colors. Wow, I love it. Now we are inside. Look guys, how pretty it is. It's just very hard sometimes to understand where you are. It's like a, a labyrinth kind of, but there is a bunch of cute of coffee, cute places, jewelry, bags. It's such an adventure. Even right now myself, I have no idea where I am. <laughs> there is too much people. It's way too challenging, so we couldn't get the focus of the camera. It's too busy. So we're still around the Grand Bazaar. We show you a little bit of inside and how chaotic it is. But the best is also around the Grand Bazaar. There is a whole life going on with a lot of street food and a lot of good things that I love. And right now we're gonna have some food. I think it's right here. It's a very popular place. Would you like a Durum? Durum estiyor Tabii ki. Tamam. Tamam, tamam kanka. I got you. İskorum durumçu Mustafa. Mustafa. Tamam abla. Abla buyurun. Eh, evet bu benim. <gülüyor> ben ve Markus arkadaşım. Evet arkadaşım. <gülüyor> İyi misin abi? Ben de teşekkürler. Yemek istiyorsun? E, ben de. <gülüyor> Ve ne istiyorsun et durum? Ya. Tamam. Tamam gel gel abi. Salfi var mı? Ya. Buyur abi. Abi çok teşekkür ederim. Sağ ol. İki tane durum et durum. Acıyesiz süt lütfen. Acıyesiz bir yere mi daha sonra? Lavaş ince ekmek mi? Lavaş lavaş. Gel iki kişi istin lavaşa. Şey olmuyor. Acı olmuyor. Ne haber? İyi misin? Bir geçen Instagram'da gördüm. Teşekkürler. <gülüyor> Çöp var mı? İki tane el doğru macisiz. Lavaş. Lavaş. <gülüyor> Kaotik. Ha, burada evet. Tamam. Bir tane bu. Ayran istiyorsun? Yeah. İki tane ayran. İki ayran iki şurta abi. İki Lütfen. Ayran. Ve kredi kart. <gülüyor> Süper abi. Teşekkürler. Çok kalabalık bugün ya. Üf. Ama güzel. Para güzel. <gülüyor> Bak sen mutlu. <gülüyor> <gülüyor> Teşekkürler abi. Hadi bakalım. Bir fotoğraf çekelim. Tabii tabii. Yemeğini. Tamam bekle. Oturuyorum. Tamam. Geliyorum. The street food is always the best anyway. So let's enjoy. Let's see. Mm -hmm. I love it. <gülüyor> tamam gel. Ama bekle. I'm full. <gülüyor> bekle bekle. <gülüyor> Eyvallah. Teşekkürler abi. Yemeni orada çekeceğiz. Tamam. <gülüyor> I love the vibe of the street food because you are with everybody. It's chaotic, you know. You struggle. And I love that. I don't want to be like always private and comfortable. No. Be in the chaos, be in the mess. Enjoy being with people. Have fun. Take photo with people. I love that. This is good. Mm. All right, guys. We're gonna cut. Jamil need to eat as well. So I'll see you after, guys. All right, let's go. They invited me to take a photo inside, so let's do that. It's a very old place. I've been here many times. People are friendly. Yeah. 
Pardon. Cemil gel. Vay vay vay. Pardon. Merhaba. İyi misin abi? Oo çok iyi ya. Vay vay. Ne kadar çocuğum. Kurtay. <gülüyor> tamam. <gülüyor> çok teşekkür ederim. Süper senin enerji. Sen çok güzel enerji. Teşekkürler. <gülüyor> Every time I come here they are so friendly and that's why I love the street food. People give you that energy. You don't have anywhere else. So let's get more food. Abi görüşürüz. İyi günler. Çok teşekkürler. That we have the main food. Let's get the sweets. <gülüyor> no time to waste. Let's get here. Merhaba. İyi misin? İyi güzel güzel. Yemek bitti şimdi tatla. Güzel ya. Ne istiyorum? Burada. Ben bir tane bu ve bir tane klasik baklava lütfen. Ee, bir tane çay. Cemil ne istiyorsun? Kahve olabilir miyim? Kahve ve tamam. Oturun burada okey. Burada dışarıda fark etmez. Ee, ben burada. Yok. Güzel. O saat çok kalabalık gibi. Aa. Daha da sakin. Bu da güzel. <gülüyor> oh, of. Bomba. Süper. Çok teşekkürler. Let's taste this. So those are very traditional. Those are the baklava. So this is the classic one and this is another one with more pistachio, which is the main delight of Turkey. Let's give it a bite. You know me when I eat food, right? Mmm. Çok iyi. İnanılmaz güzel ya. It's delicious. And of course, the chai. Mmm. When you do this, You become officially Turk. That does that's the Turk. Türküm doluyorum, çarışkanım. So now let's try the second one. With this one, I like it even more. Mm. Why this is too good? It's not fair. I would eat this every day, but obviously I would not have this body if I eat this every day. But it's delicious, delicious, and I love the Turkish tea. Mm. Çok çok güzel. Hmm, tamam tatlı bitti baklava bitti ve şimdi neresi gidiyor? Zincirlihan evet adı ne güzel mi? Zincirlihan it's a place that basically doesn't look like Turkey it feels like somewhere else than Turkey so I want to show you that place I almost finished my chai so I take you with me and the sweet was delicious mükemmel <gülüyor> hadi bakalım Abi sen burada mı yaşıyorsun? Evet evet İstanbul. Çok güzel. Ben çok seviyorum İstanbul. Türkiye gibi yani İstanbul güzel evet. ama Türkiye güzel. Evet ben Fransız. Teşekkürler. Sağ ol. Kanka. İyi günler. Hadi bakalım. Oh, uf. Doydum. Bitti. I'm full. <gülüyor> Here I'm still using the navigation because it's oh no we need to go down because it's it's like every time I come here I think I know but I don't know. Oh crazy busy huh? Which we need to go that way. Even my navigation get lost. <laughs> This is it. So guys. This is the little haven in the heart of Grand Bazaar, which you feel suddenly you are not anymore. Look at this. Beautiful. I love this place. How charming is that? Wow. Amazing. Isn't it amazing? Guys, right now we're in Zirjili Han, which is a beautiful place. It's a gem. It's like you find tea place, jewelry store, carpet store again. But look at the vibe and the energy here. It's incredible. And if you walk around Grand Bazaar, I will definitely, guys, recommend you visit that place because it's kind of unique and super historical. And again, it's all about energy. You know, I'm hunting energy and I like to go places that give me that vibe. And here, I mean, it's an escape. While you're in Istanbul, if you're always going around to the same place, get out. Look at this. You have a piece of history here. So much to see. I love it. So now I'm gonna take you to another hand, which I also like. Hopefully there is a coffee place that is not always open, but today I hope it's gonna be open, so I'm gonna show you that. Let's go! <laughs> so here we go, that's the entrance. Oh. 
anlaşma sağlasın bir şey yapar. Yes, what are you filming? <laughs> I'm going to the Han. I know you, but you don't know me. <laughs> no, I don't know you, <laughs> but nice to meet you. <laughs> It's very like unexpected spot, right? So guys, again, you see now, suddenly there is no one. Why? Because not many people know that place. Now you're in the secret street. Here we are, the secret spot. Come with me, look at this. So what I heard before is like long time ago, people that was coming to the Grand Bazaar to do the trade, used to leave their horses outside. And those little rooms used to be places to sleep for people that coming across the world, exchanging like jewelry, spices, fabric. Those used to be a little rooms. And right now it is like kind of like some little atelier, which people produce and make bench of different things, which is pretty incredible actually. And there is also some artists and I hope there is a coffee that actually I tried two times to come but it was always closed. So let's see if today it is open. Also there is some painter, some artist. Merhaba. That. Merhaba. Ah, so the coffee is open today. Çok güzel. So this is the coffee place that I was. It's called Under the Roof. Beautiful. Let's get in. Merhaba. İyi misin? Ben de teşekkürler. Quentin. Memnun olsun. Let's have a coffee, huh? Come over, guys, you're gonna love this. Wow. Çok güzel, çok güzel. Ya burada ben oturuyorum burada. Fark etmez, fark etmez. Merhaba. What do you think, guys? It's amazing, right? Merhaba. Ne istiyorsun? Kahve? Kahve. Tamam. Yok ben şu mine istemiyorum. Tamam. Güzel güzel. Çok teşekkür ederim. Abi bir saat şeker mi olsun sade? Şükür olsun. Ben sade. Şekersiz lütfen. Tamam. So let's have a seat. Guys if you want to sit here, take our place. We don't need. Yeah yeah we don't need. Oh sorry I didn't realize you. No no no no. Come here. This this we sit here. You can take this one. Very kind of you. Thank you so much. So you have the view. You can enjoy. Yeah. No. Or more. So tell me, what is your name? Yeah, my name is Ercan. Many years I'm living in Istanbul. And you, so you're working here in this coffee place? I'm, I'm working here with my friend. Before I was jeweler in Antalya, more than 27 years. And now I return to Istanbul. Now I'm still with Mustafa, with my partner. We okay, Memno and Mustafa. Yeah. <laughs> we open this coffee now. Which is very popular, by the way, guys. They make a movie, I think you know, James Bond, uh, with Daniel Craig, which you have yeah. a scene, he's driving a motorbike, he's coming inside this Avenue here. What's the name of this place? Uh, this is a big Validan. Büyük Validan in Turkish uh, we said. A little bit story about Büyük Validan. Uh, of order of Sultan's wife, Big Validan was made this place 350 years before. Wow. About 350 years. 200 years uh, people use this place like caravansaray for the people who come from Iran, Iraq. They make it here big business. And, and they used to sleep here. They used to sleep here. 100 years was here. Ottoman prison. How you can see it? You can see the doors of this way. For example, on the corner, every door is the same with big chains. The doors over 200 years old. Wow. Iron doors. 200 so years old. Over. We tried to make it uh, very tourist happy with our coffee and evet, I'm pleasure to meet every people here. Ben de ve sen süpersin enerji ve çok teşekkürler ederim. <gülüyor> no thank you. Ben konuşuyorum ve şimdi okay. sen benim arkadaşım gibi. Okay. <gülüyor> ben ol, ben de ben olsun. Oldu. Çok. Teşekkür ediyorum arkadaşım. <gülüyor> yani burada hikayesi bu yani. <gülüyor> İstanbul'un en güzel yeri yani. En, en güzel. Yeri. Oh, ne tatlı ya. Kızım benim. Çok tatlı. Bak, çok tatlı. Bak bak. She was small bak. Çok güzel. Eşim <gülüyor> Angela. Angelica. Ben ve kızım. Adı ne? Angelica. Angel benim eşim Rus. Ha, çok tatlı. Ve Rusya o... ve Türk gibi. Adam. Çok Adam. teşekkürler. Ben teşekkür ederim. Supersin enerji. Ben tamam, çok çok tamam çok mutlu. Ben de mutlu. <gülüyor> <gülüyor> Hadi görüşürüz. Tamam görüşürüz. <gülüyor> Hadi, guys, let's go. All right, guys, I'm so happy I bring you to that place. It was so lovely, so much of good energy and positive energy. Ben şimdi çok çok çok mutlu. Yani this is Istanbul, and that's why I remember I say I love the street energy because you find those type of people, open heart, full of story. I mean, I just love it. Like you know, he share his experience, his life, story with his wife, his daughter, the story of this coffee, the history of 
that place. And that's why I recommend you guys get on the street, meet people, talk, be friendly, try to learn the culture where you're visiting. Don't come with your foreigner attitude. No, vibe with people. So guys, again, thank you very much. I think I'm gonna give you a goodbye right now. We have been going to Grand Bazaar, coffees, different Han, and it was so lovely. I love it. Again, thank you for following me, sharing that exchange, this positive energy. And I hope I'm gonna take you on so much more adventure, so much more activities, and keep on sharing. Subscribe, follow, and share love, guys. Thank you very much.